Today on Newsbreak Sports, we'll have a rundown on all the week's events. We'll also take a look at the weather. All this and more on this Friday, September 21st, 2018. Good morning, SLHS. I'm Carson Dutchman. And I'm Courtney Delperding. Let's take a look at your sports news for the week. It was a packed gym Tuesday night as the Indians hosted Western Christian in the Lakes Conference Volleyball Action. The Wolfpack came in ranked number three in Class 2A, and the Indians gave them all they could handle. The matchup ended up in Western Christian's favor with scores of 28 to 26, 25 to 17, and 25 to 22. On the night, the Indians tallied 10 a serves as a team. Emma Lovall led the offensive effort with 12 kills. Jordan Hamm had 10, and Kai Kreener had eight. Defensively, Ping Ehrensdorf had 14 digs, Cameron Quantz had eight, and Ham had three blocks. The team will travel to Sioux Falls tomorrow to take part in the Pentagon Invitational, and they return to conference and play in Cherokee on Tuesday. At Fort Dodge last Saturday, the girls' swim team competed in the Gary Winkler Invitational. The 200-yard medley relay team, which included Nancy Lynn Maris, placed fourth in the finals with a time of 1.58. The girls will be on the road again at Carroll on Tuesday. At the 2018 Chris Smith Invitational hosted by Sioux Central last Thursday, the Spirit Lake girls varsity cross-country team captured the title. Senior Courtney Delberding led the way, winning the meet by more than a minute. Other top 10 finishers for the Indians were Jenny Dykema in 5th and Emma Hackbarth in 8th. Annika Stecker placed 14th, Shauna Pobuda placed 21st, Sophia Butler placed 33rd, and Grace Radcliffe placed 40th for the Indians. The boys also had a solid showing, finishing 4th as a team. Senior Aiden Bauermeister earned the team's top finish, placing 5th with a 16-29. Jacob Ponsett placed 19th, Will Block placed 24th, Jacob Tuttle placed 31st, Jonah Eldridge placed 33rd. Finally, in football results from last week, Spirit Lake rolled over Sioux Center 58-13 after trailing 13-7 at the end of the first quarter. Senior quarterback Connor Jensen was 12-15 passing with a total of 267 yards. He also carried the ball seven times for 45 yards. Gavin Harm had five carries for 50 yards, and Colby Richter had 49 yards on the carry. Spencer Newman caught five passes for 112 yards. On the defensive side of the ball, Newman had 10 and a half tackles, Kyler Reek had six, and Jensen had five and a half. The Florida O Indians open up the district play tonight at home against Esterville. Kickoff is seven o'clock. So this weekend is a three-day weekend, so there will be no show for a Tuesday show since we do not have school on Monday. And in case you guys haven't caught on yet, we try to end each show with adjectives of the alphabet, and today is a K day, and there's not any adjectives with a K, so... We have, can do keen. Have a keen day!